Morning everyone, uh, just welcome to my channel. It's the first time I've actually spoke on one of my videos actually, but um, just have to excuse the echo a little bit in the background, um, just in the bathroom, because it just gives you the a better view of the of the garden really, and the pond. Um, good day today actually, because I'm gonna go and get my new fish. Uh, I'm gonna go to Quenny Coy and pick my new fish up. Um, for people who have watched my other videos, uh, I actually moved on one of my fish yesterday. It was a shower um, that I actually got from Quenny Coy as well. Um, no particular reason for the the move on of the fish, really. Um, it, I'm sure I'm not the only one that's had a fish and it either doesn't go the right way or, you know, sometimes they can just lose colour and it just went a little bit off, that one. Um, so I made the decision just to, to move it. There's nothing wrong with it, do you know what I mean? It, it, it was still it was still a really pretty nice fish. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to um, to move that one on. Um, I've, got, I've only got a relatively small pond. Uh, it's just a little over a thousand gallons, I believe. I think it's a thousand and fifty. Um, but I just say it's a, a thousand gallons. I can't be bothered. But um, I've only got four fish in there uh, at the moment. Or, or will have only four fish in there at, at any time. Um, there's three in there at the moment. Obviously, I'm going to go and pick up my... Uh, actually, I won't tell you what it is. I'll, uh, I'll pop it in the video a bit later on, but I am going to nip to Quenny Coy now, uh, pick the fish up, bring it back, and uh, we'll we'll get it in, yeah. Um, but the pond's looking a little bit bare at the minute. I've normally got, a, I've normally got an acer there, just next to the, uh, the filtration box. You can just kind of, if you can say, see that gap there. Um, but I don't know about any of you lot, but it's been horrendously windy down here. So the Acer is actually pretty new. Uh, so I just dragged it into the conservatory. But I think once I get the fish in and get that settled, I'm going to pop that back outside and I'll uh, uh, I'll get a video of the, the new fish in there a bit later. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll take it from there. All right, yeah, I'll uh, I'll catch you in a bit then, guys. Yeah, just quickly before I, I nip off to Quenny Coy, um, these are my two aces uh, normally in my garden. Uh, this one here, that's the one that's down near the, the seating area down the bottom, which is still covered up at the minute. And that's the one I was talking about that goes next to the pond. It's, uh, it's quite a nice shape, this one. Um, let's try and get it closer up. It's more of a traditional style. Uh, Acer, if you like. That's a nice colour, this one's like a light greeny, yellowy colour. Uh, and then this one is a different variety. I'm not 100% sure on the variety, but it's, it's, I quite like it, it's a bit different. It's got a quite a nice leaf pattern on this one. Um, so yeah, I'll get these back out this afternoon and uh, yeah, see how they look when they're next to the pond. But I will also get some uh, footage of the fish at Quenny Coy while I'm there because if none of you have been uh, and you're around the, the Leicestershire area like I am I mean I'm quite lucky really I'm only 20 minutes away so um, what I'll do is I'll get some footage there for you because it, it's just a, an amazing setup and they've, they've got some amazing quality fish there so yeah I'll bang some uh, bang some footage in now all right guys see you in a bit cheers
Hi everyone again. Uh, yeah, just uh, getting the fish acclimatised, uh, the bag's floating. I've just popped half of the cover back on, uh, my polycarb cover. You can just see the bag just under there. I'm sorry if it's a bit echoey, I'm just back in the bathroom again. Uh, it just gives you the best shot of the of the garden really from up here. But um, yeah, just going to give that about 20 minutes, half an hour or so. Uh, I'm just going to make a bacon sandwich, I think, just while I'm waiting. And then I'll get her, uh, get her out of the bag and into the pond. The bacon, lettuce, and tomato. Boom. All right, cheers in, guys. Seems to be settling in okay. I'm just going to try them on just a couple of pellets. Let's see if I can. Oh, I can't do this with one end. Get it around there. Yeah, seems to have settled in okay. No uh, strange behaviour or anything like that, so. Just over there at the back. Try and get up some food. I don't think she's seeing it. Ah, excellent, there we go. Oh, she's taking some food anyway, so I'll wait till the sun goes in actually in a bit and I'll get a better video. I'll turn the air off and we'll do a bit of a better clip a bit later on. I'll just let her settle in for the next couple of hours. But yeah, settling in okay. Right, everybody. She seems to have settled in really well, to be fair. There she is. It's a Ginrin Karashi guy, if anybody was wondering. Let's give her a little feed as well. She's come up for some food, so yeah, all good. I'd say no signs of any distress or anything like that at the minute, so so all good. If I let me just turn the air off, I can get a better look at them. Ugh. Really nice gin ring on this one, quite equal down both sides. Yeah, really nice, pleased with it. stand on this bench actually and just uh, get a better view. See if I can get her to take a bit more food while I'm here. Let's feed in Kasuri Premium at the minute. Yeah, really pleased. So I'll keep you all updated. Um, probably do another video in a, in a week or two. 
when she's settled in, see if there's any updates, but yeah, hopefully all good. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Catch you on the next one.